The model 1870 Springfield 5070 tractor rifle. Now in the uh, manufacturing process and adopting guns, there was some uh, arguing. People were more in favor of the Remington rolling block than this Allen system. And while manufacturing the 1868s, Congress said that they were going to have to pick one and one type of weapon only. There were several different prototypes being tested. And uh, so they stopped production of the 1868s and they tried slipping some of these 1870s under the wire. Now, very similar to the 1868, other than a couple points. And they're hard to. Uh, notice. As I mentioned before, on the thumb piece, you see that one side is squared and this is rounded on the back. That's what's different. The sight is basically the same except for the little notch on the slider is machined out a little different, but basically it's the same sight. Now there were two runs of these, uh, this model gun. One, this rear sight base was almost touching the receiver was the first run and this is the second run where this was moved and uh, has a little bit of a gap in there so that's how you can tell the two different runs now when they say armory bright as a finish on the barrel this rifle still has the armory bright finish uh, some of the other ones turn like a brownish color with age but this still has the armory bright it's a pretty good condition gun original and the fittings are white okay like the plate if you notice a lot of these are kind of a brownish color the uh, breech bolts are dark or whatever from the or the breech blocks from the case hardening in that or heat treating that's what makes them either black or the color case hardening like on the 4570s also this one here the receiver is shorter on this for some reason it's a design change the receiver is a little bit shorter. I'll do a video comparing these two side by side. And the uh, breech block is both shape different, shorter, and, and dimensionally different. The size of the arch and everything else. But other than that, it's, it's the same gun just about. There's some minor differences in it. Uh, shape, sizes. In other words, this breech block will not fit on an 1868. We found that out. That's the problem I had with that other gun. It was a mismatch of parts. Also, these guns were not serial numbered. Where the 1868s uh, are serial numbered on a receiver and a barrel, these guns are not. But it's basically the same action. Some minor changes and differences nothing drastic uh, but it is a different model you know the parts some of the parts will not interchange like the breech bolt and that very few differences but basically the same type of gun same almost the same same rifle and uh, this is also the last model made in uh, 5070 after this model comes uh, the 1873 which will be the uh, 4570 caliber. They also changed the caliber over after this gun. I believe this is the last trapdoor model made in 5070.